Hi, this is Ed Rodriguez, president of the Coastal Alabama Business Chamber. About a thousand businesses strong in Orange Beach, Gulf Shores, Fort Morgan, and our neighboring areas. We've got this incredibly vibrant community down here at the beach. And you're not just important to the beach, you're important to all of Baldwin County, you're important to all Southwest Alabama, you're important to the entire state. And ladies and gentlemen, I can tell you, representing you in Washington, D.C., you're important to the United States of America. Congressman Bradley Byrne was in town last week to provide a Washington update at our first Friday forum at Lulu's. South Baldwin Christian Academy was our sponsor. And the City of Foley Police Department was on hand with their canine team members. We are so proud that the Foley Police Department has been selected to host the 2017 USPCA National Police Dog Trials in September. And speaking of hosting, the Coastal Alabama Business Chamber is proud to be serving as one of the community sponsors this week for the annual summer conference of the Chambers of Commerce Association of Alabama right here in Baldwin County. Looking ahead, our business after hours will be Thursday, August 17th at Perdido Beach Resort. And on Wednesday, August 23rd, we'll hold another speed networking event, this time at the Hilton Garden Inn in Orange Beach. On Tuesday, August 15th, our Chamber Diplomats will be presenting a general overview of real estate in Baldwin County. The event is free to Chamber members. Two more ribbon cuttings, one this Thursday at Original Romar House Bed and Breakfast in Orange Beach, and one on Friday, August 18th for the Oyster Shell Statue Unveiling at Waterway Village in Gulf Shores. It's one month away, but there's still time to mark your calendar for our annual Shrimp Festival Golf Tournament for Education. It will take place Friday, September 8th at Kiva Dunes, and you can get more information at myshrimpfest.com. Finally, school starts soon. The Chamber is collecting school supplies as we do each year at this time. You can bring your donations to the Chamber office anytime this week. Plus, the Chamber is still accepting applications for our youth leadership program at Gulf Shores High School. It's called Leading Into Tomorrow, and it provides 11th graders with monthly leadership topics and community discovery field trips. It's made possible by our investors of Advantage Coastal Alabama. Call Megan Smith at the Chamber for an application. That's it for this week's update. Remember, you can get more information on these and all of our Chamber programs by visiting us at mygulfcoastchamber.com. We're also on Facebook and Twitter. To reach me or any of our staff, please call 251-968-7200. Thank you for listening, and have a great week.